I think I might have just said plugs Man, to play. Sony but... Computer Entertainment. Uh, remember this? No, Only Audis please. Kids will remember not this. Here. Remember not the now. Audis? Remember PlayStation 2? No, please, don't bring it back. Don't bring the PlayStation 2 back. It had its time. It had its long time. Remember, PlayStation 2... Persona 4 was released well within the, like, PS3 beginning lifespan. Oh, yeah, well, like, most Persona games come way late. Like, isn't Persona 5 also going to be on the PS3? Anyway, this is Dark Cloud 2. <laughs> yeah, whatever about Persona, Dark Cloud 2. Yeah, is made a by uh, Level 5, who are the people who make, uh, I guess... Probably most they only known. make high quality rips. They make a lot of accordions. They make uh they make Professor Lightning. Oh All boy, right, so am I sure excited for accordions. Oh yeah, give him the snapback. Oh, yeah, hello so me. This Look, is it's me. Like the first thing you do when you start a new game is you customize you dress the... me. Yeah. I like how he still got the pose like he has a messenger bag when he doesn't. He never has a messenger bag. <laughs> He just has a side fanny pack. So yeah, you get to decide, uh... My costume. Yeah. So this is how we're gonna do this, Max. Yes, it is. <laughs> well, unfortunately, you're not the, the, the person we opened the game with. Well, this is garbage. Zero out of ten, Gabe. Would not play again. As a fucking... Action sequence. Welcome to Fantasy Castle. Oh man, sick POV strats. Those monsters are in my father's room. Father! Father, please don't sleep with them. Oh man. Oh, sick action roll. We're gonna have some, uh, some... Oh, there we go. Sure, okay. That's how that I'm works. I'm sure the statue sword is perfectly fine. It's not just decorative. What are you All talking about? Right, so yeah, about? O to lock on, X to sword. Uh, you uh, can also do L1 to do range attack. And this is me checking something out, uh, something out that I didn't know about. I didn't know you wow, could do this. Wow, spoilers, what the fuck? <laughs> hey, all we know is Monica is the daughter of kings. What's the... We know the her king, name is Monica. That king, man. Daughter of a She's king. also friends with Ross. And Chandler and Joey and Rachel. So the real question is, how's she doing? All right, it seems like she's on using off the night. magic. Uh, I, that backflip is kind of weird to pull off. You, it's when you're backing away. If you attack, you do a backflip, and you're invulnerable for the animation. Uh, you press R one to block, and you can charge up your attacks. Ah, uh, the power attacks are very important because they also give iframes. And also, I didn't realize that guy was dead until he got back up. Or wasn't dead. You know, I couldn't tell that my dad died until he stood up and oh, oh man, you're dead. No, not, I'm talking about the enemy. No, that, that guy's dead. And that guy's not. Are you sure? He could just be ah. a very tricky skeleton in a flesh suit. Am I the only one that just noticed his mantle just had a bunch of A's going along the middle? Don't question Scream the Scream all you like, I know my cape sure will. Of J JRPGs, okay? Dear Mother, how are you? I'm doing fine. So much has happened that I don't know where to start. Well, I guess it's easiest to start at the beginning. Uh, I'm again that who night. does that? Right, that night of the storm. Okay, so right, you know, that night. <laughs> The voice acting in this game, I believe the main voice actor is, I think the, the voice actor does Robin in a lot of DC stuff, and also I believe uh, the same voice Teen actor Titans. for uh, Lloyd in uh, uh, Tales of Symphonia. I'm pretty sure, yeah, he is Robin in Teen Titans. Yeah. And 
Man, how rain resistant are his clothing? He's managing to brush off those drops well. I don't wear anything if it's not made out of raw leather. <laughs> and uh, over here is uh, that guy's voiced by uh, Paul Eiding, who you might remember as Colonel Campbell from Metal Gear and a bunch and of other everywhere things. else. <laughs> yeah. Well. Also, fun fact: Scott Scott David uh, Menville, who play who voices Max, uh, also was Dwayne in Full House. And a lot of live action roles, actually. Who is Dwayne? What's this? I don't know. He was also on Wonder Years and a bunch of other early live action stuff. He said it's pretty old. I don't know what it is. Yeah, early live action stuff. He was on like uh, I Love Lucy. Well, can I get started? My dad Anyways. gave me this ancestral oh, yeah. ancient oh, yeah. artifact, but you know, it looks kind of cool, so I guess I'll wear it as bling. Go to it, lad. I leave it to me. And also, I got a ticket to the circus. All right, awesome. so you can uh, use R two first person. There's a more appropriate use for first person. I use L two to control your camera in first person for some reason. Yeah, why? Well, I, I have no idea why I would let you do that, but. Also, here, I'm just gonna say this ahead of time, uh, the L2 on my controller has no, it's not, it's analog, it's an analog stick, but it has no analog sensitivity. Any movement on the L2 registers at full force that direction. Yeah, it's like a fucking Ouya controller. <laughs> so, uh, Matt, what is your experience with this game? Uh, I've never actually, I played Dark Cloud 1, I played like half of it and then got kind of bored um so i actually know nothing about dark cloud 2 okay and charlie what is your experience with dark cloud I 1 played i guess up as long until, as you're talking about like, this the the, not the bonus dungeon but the act the actual final dungeon and i got kind of i think i kind of got bored with it it was also during my teenage years and oh man we still have weapon hit points uh, yeah, though, though in this, I heard in Dark Cloud 1, you could actually permanently lose your weapons. That is uh, correct, you can. Except for your dagger. Your dagger was the only thing that could go to, like, zero durability and yeah, get Yeah, in this game, th if your weapon one runs out of durability, you just can't use it anymore. Okay, Which still that's... sucks, uh, but it's a lot less bad. It's, yeah. it's an ammo system, only it also applies to your weapon melee. It is mainly problematic for the ranged weapons, yeah. That's a towel. Yeah, I wonder why there are all these just really well-designed environments with a lot of objects in them. I guess we'll just, you know, they just put a lot of love into it, I guess. Yeah, definitely no reason they, they dedicated a button to go into the first person. Yep. Not well, all. actually, you use why a different you... button. <laughs> why would you hypothesize something like that, Matt? That seems an oddly odd thing to point out. Yeah. Um, yeah, why would I? I don't know anything about this game. Also, check out that... Tom so like uh, mystery science theater robot and the giant scale and the the mallet with an act uh, an a, a saw on the end. Um, nice. So my experience with the series okay, is I've go. played Dark Cloud no, one up until unlocking your third character, where this I realized the game was pretty bad. Um, oh, and then I've the played Dark Cloud two quite a ways through, not quite to the end, but considerably far. And I know a decent chunk about the game and I'm really in love with its charm and absurdly large amount of things you can do. This, yeah, this, seem, this this already has a lot more production value than Dark Cloud Oh, Club check it 1. out, the moon. This is one of those games where they had the resources to make things. And not just in like, but instead of making it all like, oh, let's perfect the combat, instead they decided to put everything well, under the sun. Talking. Let's have a stupendous show tonight! Including clowns. Let's make this a night of wonder <laughs> and knives. All right, all. Let's get to work. I don't know what that voice is supposed to be. It's me. Get used to this Grumble character. He's going to show up a lot in the in the first chapter of this game. Oh, good. The first Can't chapter wait. of this game is interesting. It could be a story in of itself, but instead it leads into the rest of the game. <laughs> Oh man, he slept through the circus working on the vacuum cleaner. Also, on another note, I actually, and this oh, came no. up, I used it during this game, for this game, LLP. I have the Prima oh, uh, player's guide for this game. Oh, sick. I, I got used it. to own that, too. He's gone? And got he, all the pro strats. And the thing is, though, 
I don't know where I got this game from. Because it seems like a game I wouldn't pick up because it has two in the name. And I'd be like, well, I wanted to play the first one. I, I don't know where I got it from. I just know I had Dark Cloud 2. Which I do own a physical copy, even though I'm emulating this on the PC. So, fair, fair, fair trade. Yeah, that is actually legal. It's like legal enough. Ah, these accordions. Welcome to a Connect. Uh, was it level five game? I forgot Connect Five or level five. Level five, yeah. Yes, that's uh, well, it. this game in particular is very French. Like it's yes, fire. it is quite a bit. Um, the accordions in particular are heavy in a lot of the music, and I love it. Give me yeah, more. Yeah, a lot of music. Uh, the, the names of the people, like the design of the the houses in this town, like. Yeah, this is really reminiscent of, like, uh, the village in, um, Beating the Beast, almost. Yeah. Also, circus. French people love circuses. You need a ticket to go in. You also, need a ticket factor. to go in! <laughs> what kind of- okay, once again, what voice is that? That sounded more Slavic? <laughs> yeah, it, it's- It's European. And that kid just ate our ticket. I just, just ran on straight it. through it. It's, I, it's just plastered all over their face. They can't see where they're going. There's going to be a pile up soon. Oh, I can't believe it. Of all the... All right, so this is our first quest. We have to find that kid who's done stole a ticket. We had a golden ticket, and nothing could go wrong, or I don't know. But... We were going to see how clowns got made in the clown factory, and now everything's ruined. I was gonna go to the build a clown workshop. And trust me, you do not want to go to the build a clown workshop. Man, you know that guy, Augustus Honk, the one who got too fat after eating too many clowns. <laughs> <laughs> I mean, they basically taste like candy. It's not like they have a soul or anything, so. So, a really interesting thing about this game is that a lot of the normal townsfolk are characters in of themselves. They have names they have characters so like that little girl actually a character not I just think, a well, random right villager. yeah that's why yeah, she's yeah, like voice acted once you later get a object Sorry, you can learn all their names though there are some characters that are more characters than other characters oh certainly so there are plenty of them that are just Did like kind of npc filler but they still have names oh yes but this some characters are actually very important, though yes kind this of. character the little girl is another one yeah oh yeah she is yep yeah, this is me exploring. Why aren't you following Grandma's instructions? Who listens to their grandmother anymore? Listen. Ain't no baby boomers telling me what to do. Oh god, that face's guy's face was very ugu with his eyes on separate parts of his hair particle. And here's me trying to run away from my problems. It's like that red-haired kid came that way. I don't know why, I just decided, like, I should just leave, but, you know, never mind, I don't want to do that. I couldn't have possibly gone this way. It's the way out. It's not like the kid would try and leave with the, the ticket. Just behind. Did you see little <gasps> hey, little mama, let me whisper in your ear. Nope. Do you see anything? He had a hey, hey, call. have you seen a little rare kid? <laughs> do you know any <laughs> sailors? I want to know where some sailors might be. Basically, this is, you know, this is the second, you know, Shenmue spiritual successor after Yakuza. So with the with the moons, does that mean Sailor Moon is more strong here when we're talking about Sailor? Well, no, or... one's, one's the moon and one's Sailor Chibi Moon. Oh, of course. <laughs> like, her daughter the from the future. The saint of Dark Cloud is Chibi Moon. Which moon can you see from here? Oh, and that tells you you can use first person. The thing we've been doing. By the way, I don't yeah. think I don't know. I haven't gotten all the way through the game yet in recording. I've gotten like a decent amount of hours recording. I don't know if the fact hey, that there are two hey, moons ever comes up. I I they can't just call recall. it the moon. Once again, I didn't finish it myself. I see. They just call it the moon. They don't call it the moons. Huh? It's just the moon. So Matt, if what if there are two moons and one killed the other with a rock, would that be fucked up or what? <laughs> Four hundred ten billion moon. dead moons. Gotcha. Ha! Huh. 
I knocked you down. That means you are enforced by law to give me back my property. I mean, you saw how he tackled. I would be kind of done after that, too. <laughs> but, like, they stood up like nothing was wrong. And it's just like, okay, now you're obligated. Give me back my property. I promise I'll never do it again. All right. Here you go. So I'm certain this mysterious kid with red hair or that Come eyes on, you can't see will not be important at all. Really? Yep. I mean... I'll go see you next time. Wow, thanks, really! Better wow, gee whiz, thank you, mister! Okay, <laughs> Their feet, the bottom of their feet have had a slightly different texture than the rest of them, I guess. That's how you know they've lived in the hard life. Ain't got no shoes. Also, there's a bug flying around my... What? Is this the prelude to before they turn into Bahamut? You might be able to do it. See, it was a secret I test of character. You. You, you you chose to give up both the golden and silver axe for your regular axe, and now you get both. What is going on? Also, they, since that kid didn't have like the giant flowy sleeves, I just realized how like comically huge their hands are. It's Everyone's an, hands are it's really anime. Anime. Yeah, it's, it's yeah, I know. I know it's everybody, but it's just because that person wasn't wearing the same clothes <laughs> as everybody else. So a big reason for that is this is in still relatively early in the PS2 cycle, and so doing models is a bit difficult to render. You know, this game looks fucking console. good for like a mid-PS2 oh, yeah, no, game. It really does. Yeah, they they stylize the shit out of it. But so the way they can do the hand, the reason they do bigger hands, that way you can actually individually animate fingers better. Ah, uh, yeah, that makes sense. The same, yeah. Sorry, but kind of like how how well. the fucking uh, reason that all the uh, puppets in Thunderbolt Fantasy are left-handed is because uh, the puppet, like they they have specific animation, like the part that animates the right hand, left hand, is the right arm of a person. So, like, yeah, if you notice with some of these NPCs, their hands are much smaller, but they don't really do anything. Yeah. yeah they, these aren't hand users. Listen, Max's hands are good for preparing vacuums and tackling children. By the way, this... Uh, when, when yes, my test thank you for admitting my skills. My skill set involves tackling that's what, children. That's what, your, that's what your giant yaoi hands are good for. <laughs> Listen. <laughs> that and other things relating to their name. Also, Max, is your name short for Maximilian or Maxwell? Because I know this Ma the other Max is Maximilian. You know, I'd like to say it was Maximilian, but no, I don't have. it's not short for anything. It's just Max. It literally is just Max. As a kid, though, I wanted to be longer. Like, my brother's na name, everyone calls him Sam, but his full name's, uh, you know, like, Samuel. And so I was like, oh man, I want something like that. I want to be Maxiel. <laughs> I, my, I mean, my technically legal name is Charles. I just go by Charlie for all my life. Meanwhile, Circus. Are they juggling acrobats there? They're juggling no. clowns. <laughs> Excuse me, Matt. Do you not understand this is the clown factory? <laughs> Hey, this is no good. <laughs> the Clown the Factory continues. sounds like the worst spinoff of the Cheesecake Factory. Once again, you get to go through, have a tour, and eat the most delicious clowns at the end. How do you think the people got so fat from it? Like, yeah, that's the thing of the old... It goes back to the court jester. He could make fun of the king because he knew he was about to get eaten. <laughs> That, like, limp-wristed muscle pose. <laughs> I see you, tiny elephant. Well, it's medium-sized elephant. It's kind of small for an elephant, but... Well, now it looks not as tiny. And I mean, well, you'll, we'll, you'll get a scale person. Are you sure? <laughs> They're pretty close to being scale. <laughs> Alright, now that we can see the ground, it's a bit better. Also, note the... Animation detail. Oh Jesus, her death <laughs> Linda's death stare. Also, uh I wanna give a note. Elephants what? can't jump. In real life. So this is one fucking good elephant. Wow, what a fancy elephant. Now now I know we're in a JRPG. Elephants can't jump. <laughs> like they are not built for jumping at all. I don't think they're necessarily built for death stairs either, but, you know. 
Uh, Apparently the, this one can. I could see that. I could see a, a, a fucking elephant steering you down. That's fair. They never forget. By the I way, of what the you did last forget. summer. Of the three characters, including the elephant, that have unique sprites in this little act, only two of them actually come up in a major significant way. Guess which one? The muscle, muscle man, the girl, or the elephant? I already know, so Matt, you have to guess. Well, um, you said two. You said two of them are relevant. Yeah, two of them. In one, just kind of shows up for a while, and then disappears. And never heard of again. I want to think it's the. I want to think it's the girl and the elephants that are relevant. You're meaning? Yeah. You would be correct. You're actually correct. The strong man looks detailed, but not like detailed enough. Fun fact: the girl is not part of the circus. She's the Weckman stop, uh, store owner. She just showed up, and they're like. But anyways, here's plot. Well, I noticed all your clowns had knives, and I, I know I pedal knives. So, have you found it? Well, not yet. You see. Well, you know you see. Are you really trying hard enough? You know what happens. So, uh, if you Matt, do you like clowns or hate clowns? <laughs> don't you? I'm like. He's clown I'm not agnostic. big on clowns. I'm not like afraid of clowns or anything, but I haven't really ever been particularly amused by a clown either. What about jugglos? Jugglos are infinitely entertaining. Okay, fair point. I will I will attend a dark carnival. <laughs> I want to bathe in those Fago showers. But we've turned the mine inside out looking for it. We couldn't find the trace. Have either of you seen Hell on Wheels? No. Well, also, to anyone who has, the guy who runs the company, basically this Also, clown. this is someone's fetish right here. What, a, a guy getting... A, a, a meek mayor getting choked out by a clown with his cane? Look, don't shame me, all right? <laughs> you want to see a guy just get, get the crap out of him by a clown? But the people in this town... Really are living the sweet life, huh? Look, just because my hand is reaching slowly lower doesn't mean anything, all right? Your giant hand. <laughs> my giant clown. Hand. Such a pack of ninnies. No Sorry, guys. In real life, IRL, I am in fact a clown. <laughs> you can't tell anyone about I'm coming out of the tiny car to tell you this. <laughs> also, nice noble woman's laugh there. Oops. Darn! Who are you? Max? Run! Hurry! Okay, sorry! <laughs> Wake up, fools! Ah, oh, clown squad, assemble! Yeah, that's where you put them when you're done with them. <laughs> you'll you find don't... that the clowns in this game are not people. <laughs> yeah, exactly. You leave them in boxes because don't let them what think they're people. Get him! Man, clowns got some ups. Yeah. Well, they're it's also the, acrobats. It's the elite clown royal guard. Man, they're not though. elite. They're, they're not elite. You're about to see how not elite they are. As they're about to get clowned by a fucking... <laughs> like that clown, that clown, he probably broke his neck. He's dead. Or at least dead of humiliation. I've said there wasn't a voice actor there because I just wanted to hear someone say you're gonna die in a clown voice. I mean, we, we, we can see Max just Super Mario a clown. Really, I'm gonna feel gypped off now from whenever I go to a circus and don't see at least three clown murders. It's what the people paid to see. Ah, good, I am glad that he is a train. 
making the good steam engine noises when climbing. Ah yeah, so Cloud's natural weakness, height. Oh wait, that's mine, shit! Oops. Dang, I forgot this maximum occupancy was only three clowns and not a boy, too. I'm and not sure the circus remains, like, lit from the top because he just dropped the... That's a look at the other lights. <laughs> that was just, like, the mood, like, the the thing for the laser Matt, light show. the circus is always lit. It's fucking lit, fam.